Alright, so hey guys, welcome back to JForce Gaming and today uh, I am doing some um, very special video because um, uh, upon digging my storeroom, so I'm clearing out my storage room and I found uh, these two really interesting item which is um, mouse, uh, yeah, was not, nothing special but the thing is these mouse are very old mouse, alright, this one is a uh, normal USB mouse with the ball roller so there's a ball inside instead of the optical sensor so this is a really cool mouse and even more interesting is this one this is i don't know where i get this from but this is the wireless 4d mouse we have two scroll wheels and it's wireless and it's, it's from the night the 90s so yeah these are two really um interesting retro tech that i would love to uh, unbox and show you guys before i throw it away but um yeah, I just hope it still works because I am. I will try. If it still works, I will try to game. Uh, I will just plug it into my system and I'll try to play a game of Valorant with it and see how well it it, it plays games. Basically, how well it plays a uh, first-person shooter game. So, yeah, I think it will be really interesting, and I truly hope that it works. So um, so yeah. So now let's get to the unboxing of these two amazing mouse. Let's go. Alright, so now let's start off with the Retro mouse. This is not a wireless one. Let's see what is inside here. So, um, yeah, so this is the mouse itself. Damn, this is a really tiny mouse to be honest. Alright, it is called the uh, Micro 2000 3D Mouse Endless Life Fashionable Style. Like, <laughs> Uh, it's about 350 I bought last time. I don't know how long it is to go, but yeah, it's a 3D mouse which is really cool. And as you can see, it has a USB and it uses a roller ball. So, um, still pretty cool. It's really cool, guys. That is so good. This is the ball itself, the rubber ball, and it's inside here. So, yep. So it it the there's a, the mechanism inside to, to see, uh, you know where the axis and the y axis go. So to measure the axis of the ball, which is really cool and yeah, it's really amazing. So yeah, this is the unboxing of the uh, re the retro um, USB mouse. Right now, this mouse aside. We have the wireless radio 4D mouse. So this is a wireless mouse and what's interesting is that this mouse has two scroll wheels, which is really interesting. Yeah, it's wireless and uh, yeah, all the you guys can pause the video and ready up. So but yeah. It is super cool. Look at how 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 old this tech is. Internet Explorer. And um, so we're gonna unbox this mouse and see what's inside here my handy pen knife all right and I have a sec. let's see what do we have in here whoa this is some retro stuff man all right box aside this is the mouse itself is quite chunky. Alright, sides. I don't think I can play with this mouse because I think it uses a PS2 cable. Damn. Look at the floppy disk. I haven't seen this in ages, man. Oh. Damn, the installation driver for this floppy disk. That is some retro stuff, man. That is really cool. Okay. And we have, well, I don't think this battery is working because it's like at least 20 years old. But yeah, they have batteries in it. It's not leaking, so it's pretty good. It's pretty cool. And they have this one, wireless, large wireless sen sen sensor that connect to the PS2 of the back of a PC. I don't think my PC have this PS2 uh, connector anymore, but um, 
it's very really cool to have a PS2 connector and this is the uh, the wireless module I guess yep you can switch between channels maybe you can connect up to um, two I think uh, two uh, probably two wireless mouse I guess not so sure but yeah that's what I'm thinking because you can switch between two channels so yeah really cool and um, let's take a look at the mouse itself so Oh, mouse. The mouse itself it still uses the ball, the same thing as the ball. And uh, it's wireless, so you use the battery. This is where you place the battery in. That's pretty cool. And there's a button. No, it's not really a button, but yeah, it's not a button. It's for you to rest maybe your thumb over here, so like. Yeah, but it's pretty cool to have, you can see, to have two scroll wheels here. I mean like, you don't see it anywhere uh, on normal mouse nowadays. Even last time, I don't think there's really a two wheels scroll mouse. <coughs> but yeah, it's pretty cool guys. It is really awesome. There's a ball, see if you can get a ball out. Yeah, I could. So yeah, every mouse that has a ball one, you could, yeah, you can able to get it the ball out. That's the same ball as in the previous mouse. And that's what inside, so yeah, it's basically there's a roller inside there. So when the ball, you know, let's say move in the y axis, oops, I move on the y axis, um, this one will move at the y axis. So you know, you as an input to the computer that say, oh, it's the mouse is moving to the left. So yeah, it's really cool. And the ball is really cool. So people use this in the past, they use it to clean the ball because you can accumulate a lot of dirt inside. So yeah, that's a you know, great, awesome way to use this mouse. So let me just cover this thing up. Yep. Oh, I didn't realize there's a manual here with me. Damn, this is some real old paper. I right, saw so this is a quick start guide, two wheel mouse quick start guide. And then there's a receiver. Oh, so you can go to two mouse, I'm correct. Like the, you can select two frequencies in the mouse, so uh, you can connect to two different mouse. Really awesome. Yep, these are all manuals. It's really old and yep, the, the paper has turned like disgusting. But yeah, so uh, these are pretty much in the um, wireless mouse set. So um, so yeah, these are what basically in a mouse set. You got a wireless receiver, a mouse, a floppy disk for you to install the drivers. <laughs> She's really awesome, I love floppy disk. I haven't seen this in that time, yeah, when I was primary school, I'm still using those old kind of PC which uses this, so this is the last time I've seen it. Many, 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 many years back. And of course battery, so yeah, this is pretty much in the wireless mouse from last time. Look at the, how large the module is. And this is the cable mouse. At least this one still have a USB, so I can at least connect this to the PC and play with it and see how it is. Yeah, so that's all for the unboxing now. Let's connect it to my PC and see uh, can I play Valorant on it. So let's go. Alright, so now I have this mouse and you connect to my system. Now. Oh, oh, we have something. We have something. Oh, it works. Oh my god, it works. It works! Okay, let's try to launch Valorant. It works! <laughs> wow! But the thing is a bit flimsy, so the mouse is like very weird. Like, I have to, oh, the scroll wheel works, it's amazing. <laughs> this is awesome. I just have to scroll all the way to accept. So uh, while well, Valorant is downloading, uh, I will see you guys when Valorant is downloaded and see how well we can game on this mouse itself. Okay, uh, so it, it doesn't work, like, it only worked for a while, then after that it, it just totally doesn't work at all. I tried different ports but it just doesn't work. So unfortunately I can't play any games with this mouse. I was initially very excited to try it out but I couldn't get it to work so... So yeah, anyways, I hope you guys liked today's video and uh, do give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel 
uh, for more videos like this and uh, stay safe and this is J-Force Gaming. Peace out. Peace out.